Hello there, my name is Simon and in this video tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to easily connect your domain name to your website at SiteGround. The process is similar across all providers so you'll certainly find this information useful no matter the company you're using. To connect your domain name to your website at SiteGround you need to tell your registrar, the place where you bought your domain name, where your website is actually located. You can do this by giving them information such as the name servers or IP address of your provider. In this case, SiteGround. To point your domain name, we recommend setting your domain to use SiteGround's name servers. The SiteGround name servers you should use are ns1.siteground.net and ns2.siteground.net. This is by far the easiest way to connect your domain to your website at SiteGround. It will benefit you from our super fast central DNS service and you'll be able to use emails and take advantage of all the in-house services with this domain on our servers without any hassle. The other way is to update your domain A record and point it to the IP address of your website at SiteGround. Once you're logged into your SiteGround account, go to Websites and under the domain you want to point, click on Site Tools. Once there, you can find the IP of your website by scrolling down to the IP and name servers section. It's a bit more complex as it requires changing the DNS records manually and we don't typically recommend it unless you have a very specific DNS setup you'd like to keep. Now, to connect your domain to SiteGround's name servers, you need to do it with your current domain provider. Look for a section called Domain Management, Manage Name Servers, DNS Settings or something similar. Let's take a look at how to replace the current name servers with ours using a third-party domain control panel. Remember, the process is similar for all providers. Alright, in this example control panel, you can navigate to Domain List. Next to your domain, click the Manage button. Then find where it says name servers and switch it to custom DNS. Here you can input SiteGround's name servers. And once you're ready, click the checkbox on the right. And that's it, you're all set. And don't worry, we'll link a step by step tutorials for major providers like GoDaddy and Namecheap and a few more in the video description below. Once you've saved the changes, wait a few minutes and check if you've done it right by clicking the update button in Site Tools. If it disappears, congratulations, you've successfully pointed your domain to SiteGround. One final note, after you've pointed your domain, there'll be the so-called propagation period, where your changes are spreading across the internet. During this time, it's normal to see some issues in your website, like errors, even if you've set everything up correctly. Usually the propagation takes around 24 hours, but in some rare cases it might last up to 72 hours. Your website will load from SiteGround smoothly once this period is over. And that's it! You've now pointed your domain to SiteGround servers and successfully connected it to your website. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to our support team. Until next time!